Hello YouTube and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sarah. You can call me Mutano. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Uh, you're going to get to see my face uh, further on. But on this vlog, we are accompanying dad for a work trip. So we are just going to be tagging along. So we did a little bit of shopping uh, for the house that would last maybe three days before we leave. Today's on Thursday. Uh, we're supposed to leave on Sunday, so yeah, stay tuned and see how our trip went like. Hi, so I came to my bedroom to hide from my son because I feel like the day is running out. I'm like I'm running out of time today because I'm supposed to study. I have exams on Sunday and Saturday. I have to do the laundry. I'm supposed to edit a video and up and upload it today before 3 p.m. Today is Thursday. What else am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to pick up uh, some suitcase from my mother-in-law because we don't have a big suitcase. What else? <laughs> I feel like there's so much to be done, especially on my study load. And I feel like I'm running out of them. So right now, I want to have breakfast. It's currently around 11. I want to have breakfast as I edit the video that I'm supposed to upload by 3. And then... After that, I'm gonna study as the clothes are washing and then there's something else I'm supposed to do. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Yeah, I basically want to do most of the stuff today because tomorrow, oh yeah, and I'm supposed to refill on my vitamins, my supplements. So... <laughs> I don't know what time that will happen, either today or tomorrow, but tomorrow I'm supposed to go take a COVID test and I think I'm going to get my supplements, I'm going to refill my supplements tomorrow as I take the COVID test and then tomorrow I'm do more stuff, so yeah, I have like two and a half units to study between now and tomorrow. Because my exams on Saturdays are back to back, so I have exams, I have four, four exams on Saturday to sit, and then on Sunday I have three exams to sit. Uh, the last one is ending around 3.30, and that means once I'm done I'm supposed to drive back here and just go. I won't have to do anything else, I think everything I'm going to do on Sunday morning, like I'm going to wear clothes that I'm going to travel with, my hair, everything, I'll do it morning. Anyway, um, to packing, I packed Baba Luke's bag uh, clothes first. So I packed his t-shirts, his swimming shorts and underwear, his belt, uh, his trousers and shirts, um, and then some socks. His profession doesn't require him to wear too official, so yeah, it's just some casual clothes. Uh, so I packed enough shirts. They're supposed to be here for seven days, so yeah. For baby, I packed his lotion, his baby list. He needs to be smelling fresh, fresh. He's bathing in uh, shower, shower gel. I carried all his medicine, carpo, gear, and this is some massaging oil. Uh, that's liquid paraffin. If you're a parent, you must know that. That's for his nose, those two. One is for drying mucus, the other one is for loosening mucus. And then I have the teething gel and this mini for in case he has diarrhea and then he's comb and then all his clothes for myself I just packed my essentials shower gel my face mist my, <laughs> my perfume my makeup my balloon my cleanser my sunscreen my face whatever I don't know what that is but I used it a lot and then our documents it's just uh, passports and then I packed my underwears, I packed two dresses, I packed plenty of um, spaghetti and just comfortable shorts because I think I'm going to be spending a lot of time as well. 
just chilling with their child so i didn't carry anything fancy just two dresses for when we decide to go out uh the rest i can just walk out with them anyway it, this is saturday morning i'm headed to school so good morning good morning so a quick update on um today so today is saturday i have four exams to sit and i'm already at school my first group is starting around eight I think it's around seven, almost seven. So yeah, I'm gonna spend the entire day in school. <laughs> it's like a crushed, um, what is it called? Like a crushed sister was upset, but yesterday I managed to get my COVID test and it came back, it's negative. Um, I managed to pack all, um, I think I packed almost everything. The only thing that is remaining is uh, my Luke's carry-on bag. So I'm done with one paper. I'm gonna start for the next. In the next, I think I have like an hour and a half to study for the next. It is just too much going through my notes and then go in, do that one. The other one is gonna be. 30. My last paper for today is gonna be until 7 pm. been away from my son for 13 hours my boobs are killing me but I'm home I'm tired I'm really tired and then I get to do this again tomorrow I'm waking up early uh, but yeah it's worth it I'm almost done with school so it's Sunday morning I have already done my makeup and I'm ready to step out today I have three exams to sit so yeah see you out there anyway uh this is sunday morning i finished with school and we were now on our way to the airport peekaboo <gasps> no peekaboo No. Pick up. Okay, I'm not funny anymore. So our ETD was 6.30, we had already boarded by Irene, I think by around 6.10 thereabout 
and seated but anyway we ended up taking off almost 6 45 anyway those things do happen so yeah so by the time we were taking off it was already dark we were on board the point triple seven which is pretty pretty comfortable um yeah so the our flight was all, uh, about two hours and this guy was already on his game that i introduced him to and luke was just chilling luke was so calm during the entire flight which i was so happy because i was scared this is the f his first time to fly so i didn't know what to expect but he was quite chilled and happy and occupied and yeah it was quite a pleasant experience to fly with him for the first time. At the passport control was massive but we were given priority because of the baby which was awesome hmm? let's go fish fine girl fine girl tell us for look uh, but this time we were hungry so we were for some room service which wasn't as good as we hoped but yeah it was something so we retired for bed the next morning that we went to work and yeah that's how our trip to Addis was like see you on the next video bye bye